Good morning, Master. Good morning. It is Commander Ashtar who is speaking to you here. We from the Interstellar Fleet are having a lot of work lately. We have been experiencing several attacks spiritually as well as by extraterrestrials. We find ourselves in a big fight. Yes, a new beginning is closer and closer. We wish to bring a message stating that just like we are fighting for the good, so should you. Do not be discouraged when facing fear. Do not wane when facing misfortune. Do not tremble when facing peculiarities and things that happen in your day-to-day -day of which you have no control over. Take control in a positive way of your psyche and of your emotions. It is time to turn the key and not to be, like you say, slaves to your desires and wishes. For our projected future of fifth dimension, desires and wishes remain in second place. The first plan, we all know, is the unconditional love to God and to everyone. Experience the fifth dimension. Reclaim your emotions. Regain control over your emotions. Recover control over your feelings. Do not let negative feelings come looping inside of you. Do not relieve negative feelings. If something or someone cause you resentment, take the attitude of self-love and tell them what they are doing and change attitude. The important thing is to take care of yourself. The important thing is to love yourself and to love your neighbor. The most important is to maintain a good energy. It is important, just like our beloved Master Jesus has taught us, to overflow love. Multiply, just like you multiply misfortunes. Multiply more love. The challenge is on. Practice increasing your love. Increase the love for others. Reclaim your attitude. Reclaim your self-love. Reclaim the control over your lives and fight. Be available to fight. Of course, in a figurative sense, we don't want anyone killed. I mean, when you fight internally, you win over your fears. You overcome the differences between other human beings and yourself. It is freeing yourself from ego and becoming a human being of fifth dimension. If you wish to be in the fifth dimension, be. Be of the fifth dimension now. Reclaim your attitude. Reclaim and release your true I am so that your attitudes in oneness with God. Make sure that good is being done. Make sure that you are pouring in others and in the world. Make sure that the person you are, that the energy you are releasing and how much you are adding in the lives of your brothers and sisters 
if you are not adding anything, if you only complain, only cuss, then look at yourself, accept yourself and change now. In the fifth dimension, there won't be room for sluggish beings, for beings who have no responsibilities with themselves or with others. These beings won't get true. Do you understand? They won't get true. So prepare yourselves. Like dear Master Tanaka has told you, and has already received the information from us, you have 15 years to make the transformations. However, don't take long. Because of the fabric of space-time, if the error is big and committed now, there won't be time to correct it. You must know that until a maximum of 15 years from now, your fabric, space-time, love, high frequency, must be clean, disentangled, and in line with the energetic frequencies of the fifth dimension. Therefore, prevent yourself, take care of yourself, Transform yourself. At all instances, fight with yourself, aiming for your corrections, energetically and of the mind and feeling, so that you lead as a person, so that you lead with character, so that you lead as a being who will point towards the light and serve as hope and inspiration to others. Well then, this is my stop. I wish you all good times ahead. Thank you, Master and Friend Channel. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.